Damn, Meek, I guess it's true, man. So don't call me white girl. She mentioned she she mentioned Meek. Uh, see, like a lot of people wanted to say, like all them people going up DJ, uh, DJ Academics was hating on them, was hating on Meek Mill. They, you know what I mean? He was pushing the narrative that ain't true. You know what I mean? But she basically confirmed everything they went up there and said in like two sentences. Them niggas went up there and talked for two hours. She made this shit two sentences and confirmed it all and basically confirmed it all. Your boy Mink Mills gatekeeping. Damn. I got the audio. I'm about to press play on it. If you're from the city of Philadelphia and you know a little something or something, Meek Mills is known not to give people opportunities, period. Meek Mills is known as the kind of guy that not only will he not give any opportunities, but when other record labels might call him because he's a more seasoned vet artist, and they'll say, yo, what's up with such and such, such, he's always going to say, fuck no. Mm -mm, hell no, mm. not him. That's what the rumor is about him. Ooh. Ooh. That's fucked up, Meek. You ain't shit, Meek. We fucked with you, Meek. Get up! We fucked with you. We thought you was for the streets, man. Damn, this is fucked up to hear that. Hey, yo, it kind it kind of sound more fucked up hearing a female say that shit. <laughs> yo, yo, when females say stuff, sometimes it sound a little worse, man. Hey, that shit sound bad, man. Damn. What y'all think about that? Meek Mill, the gatekeeper. He put the key in his back pocket. 